Move. I want to see more left side than right side. We're going to just go this way right now. Go. You'll get used to it. That's why I do these drills first. Keep on going. Don't tap. Don't tap. Just turn, pivot back, push back to the post. Go. When you see this on the video, wait a second, when you see it, you're going to see yourself a little bit this way. I want to see more left pad so you're turning to an angle of the puck. Go. Better. Five more in front of the puck. Go. Good. Two more. You'll get used to it. It sucks, trust me. You'll get used to it, though. Go. All right, coming off short side post. Right to the puck, one push, back and forth. Go. Very nice, back. Thank you, see you. Back. Now keep the butt there. There you go. down. Last one. Good. Same thing going the other way. Stay there. Far side. Ready? Go. Try not to go so wide you're in the instep of your pads where you lose your balance. Just try staying on your blades. Don't come out and greet the puck. Just turn and give yourself one good push and know that you're going to be probably you know, right where that piece up. Classic is the hard thing. All right, so not bad. So you got to know that this is this is way harder to skate on, obviously. So if you're not true to your stance, you're going to fall. If you're not leading with your stick, you're going to fall. So if you notice that you're fine short side, but it's hard far side or long distance. Because you're pushing out further than you need to. On a realized now, that Go. There you go. Shot. So you're going to start on the far side puck every time. So you give yourself one push right one push right 
the shots from here, so the shots coming. All right, again, I don't want to see you breathe. I want to see you come off this pose, up, up, and then somewhere between the puck and the post with an angle. All right, challenge. You guys can do your face like that. Go. Same thing on the side. into the puck. This will be the angle I want to see you at. Aggressive and stopped and controlled. Don't overskate it. Right. Yeah, that's what I want, but now I want to see you leave with your stick. Don't look over your shoulder and don't use your butt. You're going to feel like you're over-exaggerating on this side, especially if it's your first time on it. You are. 
Stay in your stance. Go. Remember what I said. You don't want to come out too far. This is a timing shot for the shooter, not you. You're coming off the post. You're blind to begin with. You're coming out. You've got to stop and be ready for everything. Go. Stick off your pad, bend your knees. You're too top heavy, big time, especially on this ice. You might not play like that on the real ice because you didn't do it all year, obviously. You, you were compact. This, you might be growing and you're a little too top heavy. Put your butt down, focus on your core. That's better. Go. Come right Come right Take that one. Good save. We'll work on rebounds after you get a little more comfortable on the ice. Right now, I want to see chest in front of the puck. Go. Stop, the shot was coming, you stop. Same thing this way. Trying to fight through socks and pants and sticks. I mean, you're right where the puck should be. One more. Go. Why not? Save. Done. Now, starting a butterfly. Starting a butterfly at center. I'll put a puck there for you if you need to for a guy. That's fine. Center's fine. And a butterfly slide to the glove side post. You're going to come back up, shot center. Butterfly slide, six side post, come back through center, shot. I will creep in once in a while and play it. So look where you look where if I, you see me creeping in, you're your butterfly slide, stay in your butterfly slide, push out. If I'm staying out here, I like to get back on your feet. Okay? Go. Now. Yeah, 
men, you don't do this, I don't realize, because I work with you all year. You have your glove past your butt, past your leg, past your skate on your left side, trying to slide. Core, stomach, legs. Left side, go. Throwing up by now, or you're all walking off the ice with the new guys. So, they either hate it or they deal with it. At least you're here, it's only working. That's fine. Have you actually got it? Go. Right all right, you get your first. You're at the 16 and change. You get your four butterflies two left, two right, two leg, left leg, two right leg, then you get a drink. Go ahead. Control chest.
shot. The next one we're going to do from the waterfall. We're going to do the so we'll work on the waterfall in a second. And when you push through, I have to make sure. When you come through, I want to see everything at the puck, though. Don't give me, you know, stick and then body. I want to see stick or instantaneous in your body. I want to see as big as you can or be as big as you can to the shot. All right? To the scrunch or the collapse, you still have to have your pads together to have a foundation. If you open up your five hole and your groin and butt are thrusting to the fake ice or thrusting the real ice, you're gonna lose it. You're gonna lose it somewhere, it's gonna sneak in. So make sure you pinch and you have it in front of you. All right, start in the butterfly. You are gonna get up. You're gonna do three on this side and then we'll do three on that side. Everyone, yep. Go. Save. And that's fine. I, I stopped with this hands. Either your hands are here or they're here. They're not in between. If they're in between, you're gonna have all kinds of holes. So either get comfortable here knowing that you have to do this, or get comfortable here knowing that you're gonna do this. Go. Go. Last one. Are you having a hard time getting up? Are you have an edge or are you having a hard time getting up here? Go. Push. Same the other side. Go. Good, go. Push. Go. Nice chest. Nice on that 
last one. I like the fact that you had your hands good, but your chest was a little back. You rolled your shoulders forward and made a better save. Last one. Go. Push. Lower back for sure? Yeah. Sock Club Med, man, you're working out, it's trainer. The, the air don't go on until uh, like April or May. Oh, yeah? Yeah. So it's a little cool in here, but not much. Yeah, what time do you get done in school? Uh, three. What do you do afterwards? Do you have like after school stuff or no? Yeah, sometimes. I mean, he's got real ice till six o'clock, but I mean, none of my kids can even get on it because they they don't done school till four or five. So. Yeah, I have to try. Although, actually, at the end of the month, well, we have to give them lunch. I don't have much. Well, if you want to do privates on real ice, I can. Yeah. So. He has it on one side. I can do it on the other. But he has it from three o'clock until six o'clock on Tuesdays for sure. So. Huh? Well, I mean, just gotta tell me. You, but I can just schedule with him. It's, it's just sitting there. So, uh, if you want to work and all before tryouts, and you hate this stuff, so if you want to do real ice, we can. It's gonna have to be his blocks. But I mean, I can do it. I'll definitely do it. Yeah. All right. All right. Back. Thank you. 
Al Char. For one push up or whatever you would do. All right? You're at 35. You can do it. Come on. It's hard because if you're not like the little kids, they hate it. But they're so much, they're so much smaller. There's less torque. Yeah. As you get taller, and you're tall. I mean, you feel it. You, yeah. It sucks. I tell you. I told you on the on the Twitter. I said, "You sure? It sucks. I'm tired. It's fine. It's good. But yeah, I don't mind being tired. But you'll see the difference when you're in a stance and when you're not in a stance on video, but definitely on this." Go. Push, push. That's just an edge. You have to get them sharper when you're done, you know that, right? Yeah. Dance. Go. Push. Transfer. Wait, it's fine. Continue. Come on, you can do this. Go. Push. See, you're looking up at the camera, right? Yeah. Stop and lose your weight as you get. Edge? Oh, Alright, so at least you know what we're doing. Go!
side, up on the other side. Reduce the five. all the time. everything on this side so you can't you can't get mad and say oh it sucked or I mean, you'll learn just by you'll see the different angles that you're doing on this ice you might be able to get away with real ice because you're used to it but this it's all balanced it's all core if your head's down I mean you'll see it on video and you see and you feel it when you're doing it so when you're looking at this video whether it's tonight when I get home I have one more after you or tomorrow it'll be on my website just go right to your box you'll see it and you'll see the difference of where your depth is, and you'll see that your stick's on your pad. And you'll see the difference between that first stick to that stick, and where that one's good, keep your hands out, challenge the shot. All right?